Hello, welcome to Deliciosa Vida. Today we're gonna prepare entomatadas, so stay with me for the full recipe. It's tomato season, so come with me to the garden to pick up some tomatoes to make these entomatadas. To make really good entomatadas, make sure your tomatoes are ripe. That's going to make a huge difference. We have a good amount and variety of tomatoes, so come with me to the kitchen to start preparing the entomatadas. For this recipe, we're gonna need, of course, the tomatoes, jalapeno peppers, garlic, cumin, oregano, oil, salt, sour cream, diced onions, queso fresco, cotija cheese, water, and tortillas. In a pot, we're gonna add the tomatoes, the jalapeno peppers, and the water, and we're gonna cook for about 10 to 15 minutes or until the tomatoes and the jalapenos are soft. Now add the tomatoes and the jalapenos to a blender along with the water that they were cooked with. And remember that all the ingredients and quantities are going to be listed in the description box below. Also add the garlic, cumin, oregano and salt to taste. Blend everything for about two minutes. Now we're gonna fry our salsa. So add some oil to a pot and preheat. Add the salsa and cook for about five minutes. The salsa is ready, as you can tell it's a little bit thicker and it has a darker red color. Now we're gonna semi-fry the tortillas and for this we're gonna add enough oil to a pan. Add the tortilla to the preheated oil and fry for about 15 seconds on each side or until the tortilla is soft. Keep frying all the tortillas using the same procedure. It's time to assemble the entomatadas. Make sure that your salsa is warm when you're doing them. So first, we're gonna dip in the tortilla into the salsa 
and we're gonna add the queso fresco I'm using slices you can do crumble cheese if you want to but I rather do slices we fold it in three parts like an enchilada and we continue doing the same process for all of the entomatadas dipping the tortilla in the salsa add the cheese fold the tortilla and continue doing this until you finish with all the entomatadas. And cover the entomatadas with more sauce. Drizzle sour cream on the entomatadas. Also add some crumble cotija cheese. Diced onions to taste. This recipe is easy to make and very delicious, especially if you use ripe tomatoes. If you like this recipe, like this video, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so. Also, activate the notification bell for you to get notifications of new videos. And remember to enjoy life because life is a deliciosa vida. Until next time.